Hey guys, so I know it's been a while since I've done a monthly favorite, so I just decided I was going to share with you everything I was really using up in the month of September. So, I was like doing some crazy things to try to strip my hair color, and it looks black on camera, but it's more, it's got red tones in it, so it's like crazy dry from all the things that I have been doing. So, I've been loving this Paul Mitchell Moisture Mist Spray. And you can get this at your hair salon. It's usually $8.50 to $10. Then for my face, I've been loving the Revlon Nearly Naked Setting Powder. Loving this. I was super stoked because this is the first time ever I hit pan on anything. And it's just such a finely milled powder. I absolutely love it. Like the second I seen myself hit pan, I ran downstairs freaking out. Babe, babe, I hit pan. And he looked at me like I was crazy. I'm like, I hit the pan on my makeup. So I'm really super excited about that. I have just been loving this stuff. Then for some brushes, I've been loving these two brushes from the Sonia Kashuk Anniversary Collection. This one is the Dome Brush. I use this to contour. I tried using it for foundation and it definitely did not work. I had like bristles all over. So this does not work good with anything wet. Like they just kept falling out all over my face. But on dry products it works really nice. And then I have also been loving this brush here for applying my blush. And then for some eye brushes I have been using these every day. These are the BH Party Girl brush set. I did do a review on them, a little show and tell, so if you're interested in that I will link the video for you guys. But I've been using these every day. There's just so many brushes and I love them. Then for some more face products, I've been loving this Pixie bronzer I got sent in one of my Ipsy bags. I love it. I used it to contour today. It's not too dark because I'm like crazy pale so this is a really nice shade for me. And then for my cheeks, I've been loving the Maybelline Master Highlight Blush Highlighter in Coral. It's just super, super pretty, and I just love this. Now for lip products, I've been using the Rimmel Essence Snob Lip Liner. I love this thing. It is a perfect neutral pink liner, so you can use it with almost any pink. And then for my lipsticks, I have been loving the NYX Butter Gloss or Butter Lipstick in Hubba Bubba just really really pretty it's like a really pale pink and then I have also been loving my Revlon Prim Rose and this is kind of a dupe for the MAC snob lipstick and I can show you that in another video if you guys would like and then on to eye products I have absolutely been loving this Rimmel black liner this is just a gel cream liner. I love this thing and it was like five bucks. Super affordable and I just really like it. It lasts all day and it's just awesome. And then for an eyeshadow base I've been loving my Jordana 12 hour made to last in continuous almond. I use this all the time. It's more of a flesh tone color. It's not white but it's just a nice flesh tone color so it kind of blends in a lot better with your skin. And then for my lashes, I've been loving my Tarte Lights Camera Lashes. I'm wearing it today. This stuff lengthens your lashes like crazy. I love it. I love it. I love it. And the sample size is only $10. So I will probably repurchase this as well. And then I have one nail product. It is the Sally Hansen Insta Dry in the red bottle. I know they have some other drying products but the one in the red bottle is the best one that I have tried. This dries my nails in like less than a minute so that's really really awesome and it makes them super shiny. And then the last product is from Daiso. I think that's how you pronounce it. My friend Alex sent me this for my birthday and this is awesome. I have like really large pores on my nose so I just like pack this on and once it dries I just like peel it up and you see like all the gunk stuck to this black stuff and it's just crazy cool so I absolutely love that. So those are my monthly favorites for the month of September. If you want to see more monthly favorites make sure you leave it in the comments below because I kind of want to know what you guys want to see from my channel. Just leave it in the comments below and yeah I'll see you guys all in my next video.